2K released a patch for the 360 version today. Some people, their game was freezing after their first NBA game, so this patch is gonna fix it for you. And apparently the problem was with the kind of 360 hard drive you had. So the glitch only happened to people that had smaller 360 hard drives. It didn't happen to me because I had a larger one, so that should be fixed. Go download it, give it a try, see if you can play my player now. Let me jump into some my player tips now. You want to go ahead and go to the Legends Training Camps. These things are great. You can only do two a year, but what's going to happen is you're going to get a boost of plus two or even plus three in certain categories. So I went with the Larry Bird shooting and the John Stockton dribbling. And the drills are really easy. You'll see there's no way for you to fail them. And when you complete it, you're going to get a plus three. Like when I did Larry Bird's training camp, I got a plus three in three point, plus three in shot medium, plus three in some other things. I'll show it at the end. I don't remember. And when I did the John Stockton camp, I got a plus three in my ball handling and stuff like that. So make sure you use two in your first season. They'll give you a boost. Now let me show you something new that you might not have noticed. In 2K13, our my players have hot spots now. Hot spots are places that you want to shoot the ball in the game because you're more likely to make a shot there. Because that's your hot spot. That's where you like to shoot it. To see your hot spots, just go to play now, shoot around, and then press the back button to reveal where your hot spots are. Now the interesting thing about these hot spots is that they change because the first time I checked, which was a few games ago, I only had two hot spots. I had one on the right where you see it and I had one under the rim. But now a few games later, I have a hot spot on the left side of the court and I have a cold spot right in the middle of the paint. And that's actually bad because now I can't do floaters because that's where you would do the floaters. So I'm not exactly sure how you get these hot spots. I guess just based on your performance in your games, so I'm gonna see if there's a way I can get rid of that cold spot so that I can start doing floaters when I drive the lane. So this was just a quick video giving you a couple of tips. So make sure you check out your hot spots because that's where you wanna continue to shoot. The game is basically telling you where you make most of your shots. So if you're in these spots in the game, you're, especially if you're wide open, you're gonna be getting easy points. So stay tuned, I got a lot more videos coming out. I'm actually working on some right now.